Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to review Nikon Coolpix S800C after 10 long years. Is it worth to use in 2021? So without any delay, let's get started. If you look into the build quality, the camera is made up of some sort of plastic but it looks like metal. On the back, there is a 16 megapixel camera and 10x zoom. On the front, there is 8.7 cm, 3.5 inch high resolution OLED monitor with high sensitive touch panel with physical touch keys. On the top, there is a zoom slider and power on off button. On the right side of the camera, there is a HDMI port and charging port as well. On the bottom of the camera, there is a hole to connect the tripods and also slot for battery that contain of 1050mAh capacity as well as there is a salt for micro SD card. If the battery is charged full, you can capture up to 400 to 500 images. So let's turn on the device. It doesn't take much time to start. So let's check the weight of the device. I will guess the weight. It may weigh about 180 grams. Well, that was close. It weighs 183 grams. So the camera is powered by Android. It is running on the version Android 2.3. It has Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and as well as touch screen. If you come to about device, you can see the status. The battery status, battery level, etc., battery usage, and model number, Android versions. So you can see here it is running on Android 2.3. The model number, build number, kernel number, etc. So you can see these are all the settings. Let's talk about the main part, camera. There's a plenty of modes you can see, easy mode, auto mode. In auto mode, you can change exposure, micro modes, you can switch it on or off, self timer, flash, etc. In scenes, there's a bunch of modes sunlight moonlight etc movie mode there's so many modes and scenes you can click the better picture if you select the appropriate scenes so you can see there's a special effects you can change some settings over there portrait mode to blur the background is the movie mode you can shoot up to 1080p let's click some pictures so is the idol of laughing buddha the picture quality and details are turned out very well The 10x zoom in this camera turned out really well. So this is how the zoom lens works. So this camera is powered by Android. 
it looks like mobile with the camera so you can download any application like other camera applications or any gmails it has even play store as well you can share images and videos through applications like share it it has wi-fi as well so you don't want to bother about that even it has built-in gps if you are a vlogger and you have a low budget this camera is for you you can always use this camera for youtube purpose the camera quality is very good now let's connect to the tripod at the bottom there's a hole to connect into the tripods so let's screw it tight this is how the tripod with camera looks like the 10x zoom lens included an ed glass element gives you the power to capture finely detailed images from 25 mm wide angle to telescope with 16 effective megapixel resolution and OLED screen lets you enjoy that quality during shooting and playbacks. Here are some of the sample images that are captured by Nikon Coolpix S800C. Stability of the camera also turned out well. So if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button, share and subscribe. Thank you. We will meet in the next video.